If you go down in the woods today, you're sure of a big surprise. Picnic time for teddy bears. Into teddy bears for having a lovely time today. I was thinking uh, beam me up Scotty at one point. It was like I'd gone to see a really bad sooty and sweep show with Matthew Corbett. Watch them catch them unawares and see them picnic on the holiday. It felt like I was in a Ken Russell film. But John got his own back by adding an extra ingredient to the main course. Have you put mayonnaise on there? Yeah, sure. Have you? Yeah. Did he just do that? You're yeah, supposed to get it out while he's, she, oh, he's here. Oh. Thanks. Thank to serve me, but yeah. I've got him to do the wash. Some pepper. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to get this. I don't know how you react to the answer. No, 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 no. Seasoning's not a problem for me. <clears throat> it looks as though John might have got away with it. It's lovely. I really like it. Yeah. Mm. Um, I haven't tasted this yet, so I don't know quite know what it's going to come out of. I could only eat it because I slathered it with mayo. John's got some sort of white sauce on here that we haven't got. My goodness. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't know, he's got some. <laughs> what? John, what, what do you got on your plate? Um... <laughs> John, what do you got on your plate? <laughs> John, we had a conversation yesterday. What happened? Are you taking the <laughs> out of me? <laughs> John, I want to know what's on your plate. Mark! Get your belt on. <laughs> Sorry. Why did you say that? Why did you do that? That's mayonnaise, isn't it? <laughs> That's mayonnaise, isn't it? That is so disrespectful. It's not. Look, you are leaving, John. Where now, either, either I forcibly eject you or you leave honourably like a gentleman. I'm no gentleman. Uh, well, I know that, so you're going to force it. Now, just have a mouthful. <laughs> Sorry. Get your <laughs> I'm having problems, Mark. <laughs> get, get the belt on. I'm not take my, my champagne. No, no. <laughs> you're, out the, you're out the door, and when you behave yourself, what? you come back, OK? But it's not can tonight. You, can you stop manhandling me? Well, shouldn't that be tran handling? Out. It's very nice, but it's a bit too bland for me. Really? Mm. Oh. I would have liked some spices or something. Mm. Would you have any chili sauce? Um, I'll have a look. No, it's all right. It's all right. No. It's not too no, it's all right. I'll have a look. I've got some. With you. You've got some with you. <laughs> you carry your own bloody. Oh dear, mate. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I mean, do try it. It's brilliant. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> Could it be a dill sauce? Yes, would you try it? Actually, I wouldn't like to try now, thank you all the same. <laughs> Should heat things up? I won't be offended. Oh, I know what you guys like, so I'll just boil some food and meat and that's it. You like as it simple bland? as that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, make yeah. it bland and I'll be happy. Liam was very, very offended. I reassured him that it would be better if I enjoyed the meal, if I could make it to my taste, than to leave the plate untouched. It's actually an insult to somebody's food if you bring along that chilli sauce because you're not giving anybody a chance at the end of the day and everybody has their own ideas of how food should be served. Just two, three drops of that would have just changed the whole... No, but then it would make it What, spicy. in the sauce? Yeah, I, I don't agree. Mild, it wouldn't be a mild, creamy, been lemon spicy, sauce. No. More dill would have been better. Mm. More dill? Yeah. Look what Cass has started. It's tasteless, it needs more dill. What's wrong with it now? All right. <laughs> Where do I start? <laughs> you better shut that door. How bloody rude can you be? If you don't want to eat it, chuck it in the bin. I mean, leave it there, you can chuck it in the bin. You're, 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 the, you're, the, you're the, the gentleman that's serving the food. Salvo, man. I'm chuckling at the bins. That's fine. I'm chuckling at the bins. Fine. Salvo, calm down. That was ridiculous. I've never, ever experienced anything like that in my life. Never trouble work in progress. Lee, so how much have you really got to do yet? You no, start... I haven't got time at all. No. Sorry. You, you start, <laughs> you... I've got everything to do. You, well, you're the ones who wanted to try both everything, so you're going to have to wait. Interesting hosting style. <laughs> <laughs> Get that 
coming out of the way. And it wasn't just his dessert that was overheating in the kitchen. Things didn't go any better with the main. This course now is about an hour and 15 minutes late, but they won't care. They'll be all right. It's not going to be fancy done up in any fancy old way. I've washed my German bands, by the way. That's hands to you and me. I've dropped a bit on the floor, but um, don't worry, we don't want to waste it. We can get that back in there. Beautiful. They won't mind. Um, the tarragon will hide that, I'm pretty damn sure. Let's hope so. And that's that. That's number two. When he finally managed to serve his main, his guests were far from impressed. Tasty enough for you? This is, well, this is a competition, and Thank essentially, you. it's like vegetable soup with chicken in. You do this in my dinner? Yeah. Not, not well. The mashed potato actually makes me feel a bit sick. That's the tarragon. I, I don't like the taste. I look forward to the dessert. Trust me, don't. <laughs> Do you want my piece of chicken? So the bottom line is, bottom line is, you didn't like. I no, didn't like the chicken it. casserole. No, I like the no, chicken. Sorry. Personally, I think you're. Do you know what my mum always said to me? What? You're not here to be like son. Just live it. So I'm living it. If you actually, don't like it... Actually, I like to say and that you don't, to I, if, I don't, if, you don't, if you don't like it, and you don't like me, and I don't win the money, I won't lose any sleep over it. That's lucky. And, to be fair, none of us are going to keep in touch with each other at the end of the week. Mm. Well, I won't, because I, I, I wouldn't, wouldn't do it. I wouldn't say that at all. Uh, Lee, maybe you should quit while you're behind. I won't be keeping in touch with anyone after this. Well, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I've offended you all. I wonder why. Did you get that impression? <laughs> wow, you're I really off the mark. Well, you are being a bit, you know, don't you think you've been a little bit harsh? I'm being mm. honest, I'm being me. Oh, well, cheers. So you don't want a creme brulee, shall I just boot you all out now? No, we're not. Because you all hate me. No, 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 no we don't hate you. you. Lee. Shall we get Lee? Is that you hate us? No, listen, I love I think you're all great. Because you said you said, said you think you're not because you don't like my chicken. Pulo Pritchard, named to perfection, absolute rubbish. His last zero, 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 zero. It's one of them fish voting as well, then, Mike. But Lee's still convinced he can sweeten his guests with dessert. Look at that. It's a fruit tower of excellence. Your guests will be the judge of that. For me, that's like really sort of thin cream, but that's yeah, we both like it different, don't we? Yeah, no, of course. Do you just like it thicker, so. It just tastes really, really nice. It does. Somehow, I don't think he believes you. It just tastes like runny custard. The meal tonight was absolute crap. I deserve um, at least ten just for effort. Clearly. On Planet Pritchett, maybe. So tonight, Lee, I'm going to give you a three. And I think I might have even been generous with that, to be honest. I can only give Lee a three. Lee, you're lucky. <laughs>